sure the audio is going right <clears throat> see if I'm turned up to 11 11 to 12 turn up to the highest of swag magnificence oh that was confusing let's see Alright, let's see. I should be currently live right now. Sounds pretty balanced. Uh, so I think I have one person running. Uh, I've heard one person watching. So uh, get into it. Let me. People can let me know if the audio is too loud in one area or not. Today, I believe what we're doing is the desert area. Uh, I don't know, because Rare Tops is alright, but like, Rare Tops puts you through some shit, and sometimes you're just like, I'm not in the mood for it. I'm not in the mood for your shit, Rare Tops, is all I'm trying to tell you. I'm not in the mood for it. She's fine. She's just like one of those, like, dickish best friends you have. Uh, what I like to call this map, this map is Fan Service Island. Okay. Since apparently you're scared. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm glad. I like the dynamic between Risky and Shantae. But also, I just find Shantae adorable. And Shantae's like, nyeh. Nyeh. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. Anyways, let's continue. Uh, and now we're in our desert area. Uh, the thing about these enemies is they shoot spikes, so it always. Why are y'all running this way? Oh my god. Die! Ah! 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 This area is fine. Uh, this part will probably be known as Fan Service Island. That's what I like to call it. You'll see why as we continue with this in the dungeon. I thought I was doing. Oh, I'm doing seven damage. Listen, I thought I said. I thought I said one. I was like, what? Yeah, I shouldn't have done it. I'm sorry I took a break. Uh, suck it. I hate these fucking things right here. Which means I don't want to go this way. But if I remember correctly, this is where I actually can get our old buddy's sword. Well, I need this, actually. Oh, yeah, I still got... Yeah, this is where you can get uh, the dude's sword from the last part. Now, they expect you to do this with an upgrade you get later to get through this section. Uh, when I played the Wii, the 3DS version, I found out I could cheat it. You can actually make this pretty easily, but the thing is, there's no point in doing it because uh, even if you get the blade early, it won't. The event won't trigger anyway, so there's no like until you get the actual ability that you're supposed to have to get this damn sword. There's no reason to get it early. I can, but there's no point in it. Also, it just requires a lot of dying, and uh, nobody's a fan of dying. But let me rephrase this, I'm not a fan of fucking dying. So with that being stated, I don't even want to deal with this thing. 
I don't like her. I don't like Dylan. She's like, that's the only, I think that's like one of the only places she's at, and I can't stand it. Because that fucking, that Scorpion has been a bitch in like every game she's been in. Fucking, that's my monster girl. Anyways, let's proceed. Uh, right now, we're just heading to the dungeon. By the way, this will probably be a decently long part. Because of our, from what I remember when I played this section with 3DS, I was like, the first half is kind of annoying because it took me a minute to realize what I had to do. The second half is annoying because you're going to, well, I'll wait until we get to it. I'll wait until we get to it. For right now, we're just going to make our way and traverse the land. So this is what we need. Hey, look. Is it, I guess this is the dungeon. Or the sarcophagus. Squid Baron? What the hell are you doing here? What's wrong? Is this where that vacation packet took you? Wow, what happened? Oh, and all you're in is... Oh, I see. You were cheated out of... Uh, it was a scam! I don't think you paid anything, did it? Oh. Oh, no. I like how Shantae's just kind of been different this entire time. Oh, Squid Bear, no! No, you can do it! Shantae, don't, don't throw cliches at him. Oh, apparently cliches work for him. Why do you have expert? Oh, I know why you have expert specs. I should give these to Bolo! <laughs> Although, I wouldn't give him the Bolo. I would send him to it. I would send him the, the specs in the mail because if I gave it to him now, uh, something tells me he would bullshit me and I'm not in the mood for his shit. Also, they would start fights. What's up, Jonathan? Oh, what's. A wolf? Try? What? Okay. We all need to hurry up. And this is where the backtracking starts. See? We can't get into this dungeon until we know the code. Actually, I don't remember. Do we already know the code? We probably don't. What I probably have to do is get the x-ray specs. Yeah, we don't have it yet. So, with that being stated, we have to go back. What's up, J-Man? So our current position is we have the X-ray specs, but we gotta figure out, we can't get into the, the actual uh, tomb or dungeon until we know the code. And the code is written on the sarcophagus, which we can't currently read because we saw what happened to our old buddy Barracuda Joe. He tried to read that shit. That man died, so uh, yeah. We got some glasses now. So, what we're gonna do. I'm over here. Bye. <laughs> oh, it's not over here, is it? No, it's not. I'm just avoiding them completely because I could go over there and fight them, but it's not really worth it. I'm kind of surprised this game doesn't have a level up system, let's be honest here. The way this game is structured, I'm like, why isn't there a level up system? Hey guys, just run into the slaughter. Thanks, and I got all these items from you. I appreciate your kindness. Die. Time to move from your shit. Time to move from your shit. Oh god. Fucking things. And that's why there are slopes in this area, because they know it's a pain in the ass to kill this thing now. So the first thing we gotta do is we gotta go back to Salva Island, which was the first island we visited. Not Scuttletown, Salva. What's the question you got, Jonathan? While I'm uh, going backtracking. This is like the first amount of backtracking you're really doing. How would you think you're gonna do? I'm gonna avoid you completely though. Die. Yeah. Time to move for your shit. Yeah, I don't care for fish. I don't like fish food! Ugh. Disgusting. Ugh. Ugh. Now I gotta remind myself. Nah, no, it's not here. This is the dungeon. We don't need to worry about this. Uh, you're talking about the anime. Uh, primarily because I had reviewed Black and White for three years and I got burned out on it. Pokemon's not a franchise you can really effectively 
Pokemon's not a franchise you can effectively review consistently. Like, you gotta really like the Pokemon and understand that what you're essentially gonna be reviewing is the same shit, just a different generation. Now, the fact that we got this Glidey thing allows us to do some shit here. So with that being stated, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cheat the system a little bit. Yep. Uh. Uh. I probably am not gonna make it. No. Uh. Oh. Oh. Yeah. We go. This is what I needed to do. Because I need to get information. Oh, why did I do that? Oh. I also don't like this position they put you in. Shoot the damn bubble. Ah. But yeah. Uh, the reason why. I don't think I have enough. Do I have enough for a heart? I might. I think it's. I forget if it's three or four hearts with you need. I mean, I like reviewing Pokemon, but like, all on top of that, I was already kind of getting burnt out. It's one of the reasons why I said they need, they need to take a break for the next Pokemon game. Because they've been kind of trying to kill you with it. Yeah, sucker. Pokemon's become way too oversaturated in recent years. I know a lot of people like it. I'm just like, personally, I gotta take breaks. This is what happened to me in 4th Gen. I took a break in 4th Gen because I was kind of burnt out on everything. Nah, I hate when they attack from above because you can't do anything about it. But yeah, that's the reason why I stopped reviewing Pokemon, just because it, you get kind of burnt out on it. I mean, I reviewed an entire fucking generation, which is fucking ridiculous. Nope. And I'm just going to casually go down here. See, what I need is a sarcophagus. So I got the first mummy sketch, but there are two more I need to get, but I can't get them here, so let's get the fuck out of here. Ah, oh, I hate the position they put you in here, right? I don't know why this is here. I always thought there was a reason why this was here, and maybe you can get through. You can, they don't fucking tell you how. Shoot the stupid bubble. Ah! I should've just... Now what I want to do is just jump down. That's not going to be a thing I can do though, unfortunately. But God damn it, I'm going to try. Uh, I might need to stock up with some foodies. So I'm going to go ahead and chomp in some flesh pops. Now in retrospect, considering this is a fucking zombie treat, this is kind of weird and awkward to be going. Also, remember... Oh, this is like one of the worst positions to be in. Uh, and it didn't work! I thought I could grab the damn thing and it didn't let me do it, and I was disappointed. Luckily, the enemies don't respond. I'm gonna have to take a hit here. Uh, yeah, because there's a... There's an ability I get later, but it's not gonna help me right now, unfortunately. So I'm gonna just take the hit. Just shoot the damn bubble. And you still cheap shot at me. It's fine. All I really needed to do was get that heart squid and get the inscription. Now I can get the hell out of here. But I believe the next ones I need to get aren't even over here. Oh my god, guys. Cut me a fucking break. Now nah, I don't care. Oh god. Ah, uh, no. I thought I could get out of there unscathed. Survey said no. Uh. Oh god. I'm getting insanely reckless here. Oh, you gotta go, Jonathan? It's fine. You can watch this in the playback. This will probably take a minute anyway, because I gotta. I'm trying to do a dungeon apart. Uh, there wasn't a mummy inscription there. I believe I gotta go back to Scuttletown. Because there's three I need. I need, like, three in total to get the whole message to unlock the tomb 
to continue on my quest. Actually, first off, I need to go take a bath. So let me go take a bath real quick, guys. The bath is necessary for progression. Alright. Take a bed. Now, I believe, if I remember correctly, I still need a few other things. Yeah. This is the second sketch. But I know I need, like, one more. Yeah, Sky's a little still salty, so. The third sketch, I believe, is in the desert area anyway. Which is fine. Let's go visit Mimic real quick. Then we'll go get the sketch. Nope. Don't do it. Don't. <sighs> Mimic. You came by to say hi. And of course, you want to talk me to death. Anyways, we got two of the sketches with the x-ray glasses. Now we got to go back and get the third. And now we got to go get the third sketch and then we can open up the tunnel. Well, not tunnel, but the tomb. The entrance! Fuck it. You need the sketch to figure out what the entrance is. So, I probably should have got it when I was here, but it didn't really matter because I gotta come back here anyway. I don't know what you two thought you were going to do. I can tell you what you were gonna end up doing. You're gonna end up dying. Nope. I'm not having none of your shit. Nope, I'm gonna have to take that hit. That's all I have to do. I'm so actually I remember these things shooting like three damn uh I thought these things shot like two or three shots, not just one. Nope. Nope. I have none of your shit. Yep, here's the other team. And now I have all three sketches. Now I know what the, the, the symbol. Each symbols I need. So bird, lion, bird, that's what I need. So now I can go back and open that door from uh, the other part in this next section. While dealing with the scorpion, oh God. Ah, uh, of course, Scorpion Woman. Couldn't cut me a goddamn break and say, hey man, you got past me the first time. I'm not letting you get away with that shit again. Come on. Oh my god. Get down here. I need you to let me murder you. So this dude stood still. He was in a perfect position to Now let us proceed. Save. Because I said so. And now continue on a journey. So it's a bird. Some of these you can't tell what they are. I think that's a bird. And the line is the middle one. And there there we go. Now the dungeon is open. So now we can go fight our destiny. At least I think it's a ten line temple. Okay. I guess there's more of these cult wolf guys. The princess. Mama Genie. Well, former half genie, I guess. We're in uh last time I checked Shante wasn't a princess though. Oh no. Oh, so am I in some type of reincarnation, I guess? What? Wait, what garb? I'm already wearing sexy outfits. I can't get any sexier. I stand corrected. Why well, wouldn't you call this? That's more Egyptian princess. I don't know how you got space princess out of that. And so, here comes... And this is actually pretty fitting. This is Shantae. Metal Gear Rising Edition. Well, Metal Gear Solid Edition. So essentially the premise behind this area is... Is that... I have been locked. 
I don't have any of my items. I don't have my gun. I don't have my parachute. It took all my shit from me. I'm back down to basic. Whipping my head back and forth. Whipping my head back and forth. Whipping my head back and forth. Which unfortunately means I have to do this classic style. But here's the other problem. See how things are pitch black here? Well, there's a reason for that. As you can see, we're escaping the position we're in. But what this unfortunately means is that the moment they spot me, I fucking love that animation. The moment they spot me, I'm sitting back here. So, as I said, we're playing Metal Gear Solid here. We're sneaking around, trying not to get caught as we get out of this dungeon. Because I don't give a fuck if I'm the princess reincarnation or not. I got other shit to worry about, and I don't have time for this Tom Fuller right now. You also can't even jump in their line of sight, so. You can jump above them, you just can't jump in their line of sight. And because, as I said, if you jump, like, even if your head touches the area, you still... I don't know what I was doing. That actually scared me. Oh, I was going out this way. Yep, see, they even see your legs. So just keep that in mind. This area is not inherently hard. But it's been a minute since I played it, and I'm being stupid. It becomes easier to hide in the later sections. The section isn't even that long, to be honest with you. This is where you gotta do that short hop, you know, that Smash Brothers shit. I'm getting quiet because I'm trying to avoid getting caught. Because they actually take you all the way to the back if you get caught. Which is one of the most annoying fucking things. It was also incredibly annoying for those. See, that's, that's terrifying. This part is actually worse in my opinion. This is still the easy sections. That's the funny thing, this is still the easy shit. I don't even think there's checkpoints here. No, I think I think if you fuck this up, you gotta go all the way to the back, which is kind of aggravating because there's no. I think there's like one save point, but it's not here. So here's the key. We got the key. I'm feeling accomplished here, but we got more to deal with. Luckily, they don't see you this way. Now, this section introduces the mechanic of. You can actually hide behind shit. You're in the darkness. But it's like, I think it's only in these like middle sections. But it's so hard to know that, that you, you, you'll end up risking getting caught anyway. See? It, that's bullshit! That's complete bullshit! But then again, I did run right behind him, so I guess, I guess I technically deserve that, but it, as I said, it's still a pain. So if, you, if you're not good at this, Let's go. It's, it's kind of like the Roddy Top section, except I think it's more unforgiving than the Roddy Top section. The Roddy Top section at least starts you off at the beginning of that screen section versus this. Whereas this actually makes you just go, nope. If you're doing it, you're doing it all from the beginning, bitch. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I'm struggling way more with this than I did originally. Or maybe it's the recording, Chris. When I'm playing live, I'm actually worse at the game than I actually am. Because I got this like in my first few tries. I don't even think I, I didn't get sent back but like once or twice. I'm also playing this on a goddamn controller, Analog 6 versus goddamn uh, Shore hopping would be something people need to keep in mind when you're doing this section. Actually, I'm surprised I didn't get caught there. I almost expected myself to get caught. But life is never that easy. And this section isn't insanely hard. I don't fucking need it. So 
the next thing is next. I have a key, which I need. Pretty much your, your goal here is to get to a goddamn save point. The moment you can get to a save point, you'll be good. But right now, you're in shit creek. As I said, I'm not a huge fan of this section. But it's what you gotta do. So remember, in these gaps, you wanna get as close as you possibly can. This one's kind of a pain. It's not inherently hard, but it's just kind of a pain to do. You're also trying to cheat death, and then they make it worse by you can't see in the bottom here. Because you're really, you're pretty much running as close as you can next to him. Bye, bitch. <laughs> uh, this is when you're really gonna be hoping for save points. Like, all up and down this shit. Ugh! These fucking things. Get off the stupid. You dead? No, she's not dead. And it's like you're sitting there going, Where the fuck is the save point? I need a save point. You're like, bruh. You ain't getting a save point anytime soon. Which sucks. Luckily, these guys don't fucking make you go back to the start. It doesn't make it any more appealing, you know. At least you can take solves in that fact. Now, as you can see, there are multiple areas you can go. Which makes this even worse if you get caught. It's, it's not inherently hard, just, ugh. Yeah, because it's not hard. It's just kind of a pain in the ass to do. Like here, I think if you get caught by... Actually, I don't remember if you get caught by the people if it's an issue. But I'm not going to do it anyway. I'm just going to get the key. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Sky? What? Okay. So, everybody ended up getting caught. Hey man, that's all just a fan service town. That's all we're gonna be doing. So apparently Shante was the only one dragged into this shit. But something tells me that that is not the only person we need to free. Although Sky did have a legitimate reason for being here, what happens? They're not the only characters here. But we now know what that door leads to, at least the main area which we need keys for. So that's the point of this section. You're essentially trying to get keys. Oh my god, I fucking hate these things. These chicks are annoying as fuck. Point is, we need more keys. Honestly, there's no reason to even hang on this section. I just like hanging on this section. I don't even think they see you. No, they don't. Still not fucking fun, but you know. It's Metal Gear Shantae, man. 2018. Game of the year. Be on the lookout for it. It's coming to a theater near you. That section isn't hard right there. This section is a pain in the ass. I don't think they can see you through the wall, which is fine. But you can't make that jump anyway. Which is a problem in its own right. Also, I hope to God that you don't fall off the damn chain, because if you do, you're kind of screwed. The good news is that you don't lose your key progress. And hey, look, a save guy! Oh, saving grace. Saving grace. So this, this isn't as unforgiving, but it's still kind of unforgiving. But it's, it's nowhere near, I would call it cheap or unfair. So they, they give you this right before a difficult section, so... It's not, like, disgustingly hard. And then the sections are even still easy here. It's not like I'm struggling. But, oh god, I wanna deal with these things. These chicks are just annoying because they bum rush you. And they're not like the only enemy characters to do that. Nope. That's the second key, which is cool. Somebody's gonna jump out this. 
<laughs> I love how I was still in mid animation, so her running into me didn't do anything. Granted, that, that's good game design. Bad game design would have had me take damage. It would have punished me for that. Shanti, I told you, game of the year. Game of the year, 2016. Nigga, I don't like IGN. For IGN is neutral with me. I don't mind IGN for coverage. I just don't care for IGN or anything else. Ah. Ah. We're going to the right. Cause fuck left. But now I want their heart split. And I can't go back! Fuck you, good! And see, it's one of those... I hate these types of jumps. The ones that look like you can obviously... You should be obviously able to fit. But you can't. It's bullshit, man. Oh, God! Like, I didn't know that was coming. Hey, look! That was Sky's room. The Roddy Taps? What are you just, you're just grabbing everybody. This is illegal. This has got to be illegal. You can't be running around stealing people. This is bullshit. Now I gotta go save this fucker. Roddy Tiles, what are you doing here? Of course. As I say, she's like a dickish best friend. You like her, but to oh, dude, Shantae from Smash all day. This is like one of her. This is like one of Roddy Tiles' redeeming features. She's just kind of adorable. See, Roddy Tops views them as friends. She's just somewhat of. She just has bad personality quirk. I don't even know how to describe it. Like I like Roddy Tops. And luckily in Half Genie Hero, we get to play as her, Bolo, and Sky. So. <laughs> Look at Roddy Tops like, well, I'll leave, but I want this outfit. I'm like, alright, Roddy Tops. Well, I feel like they would have announced. Uh, I like this one because you can literally kill this thing in the damn bottle. Not bottle, I don't know why it's in the bottle. I think. Yeah, I think if they see you, they can still fuck you over. I think. No, they can't. Okay. It's been a minute. I had to remind myself. I wasn't sure. Leave me alone. And then that's the other key we need. We need two keys. Of course, the one for my room requires the gun. But we need one more key because somebody else is trapped. We should know who it is. I know who it is. But some of you may not. So, we need that. But we need to go to another room. What room that is, we haven't decided yet. Oh my god. I hate this woman. She causes me so much pain. She's such an asshole. Sorry, I'm being stupid. Alright. So we need one more key, which means we gotta go through one more room and one more section. And I'm thinking it's probably this one. Oh, dude, I would die. I would I would be in tears if they did Dr. Luigi. I would cry. I wouldn't like it, but I would laugh my ass off just for the reaction of it all. You know, that, that's like one of the scariest things to do, is to have a drop that you can't control. And this is the easy way to get back up. If you need to. But I didn't need to, but I wanted to show that it was there. Because needless to say, we'll be coming back this way. Or we can. Yes, there are emojis. I think you can make custom ones too, but I'm not genius. So we have the last key. So now we can go free our third friend. Who the third friend is. You should know because there aren't that many characters you can do this with. And as I said, this part is fan service island, so that should easily tell you who it is. But in case you don't know, well, Nurse Nurse Peach I actually would find more entertaining than Doctor Luigi, because I don't want shit. I don't want characters who are canon. Fuck canon. Canon isn't funny. Oh my god, you're gonna turn around in a minute anyway, and you explode upon death. So fuck. Anywho, let's go see who's in this door. Risky, what the fuck? 
I told you to stay on the boat, Risky. What are you doing? This is actually the cutest Risky you will ever get. You came looking for me. How did you come... You came looking for me? Oh, that means you care, Risky! Also, I'm a little mad because apparently the dress looks better on you. This is when you realize that Shantae is not the most uh, sexually attractive of the girls. I think actually, I think I, I didn't notice it until this, this section. I was like, Shantae doesn't have the biggest breasts in the game. I think like Risky has bigger boobs than her. Which I'm surprised they don't make a joke about. So we have all the girls. We've saved everyone. So what is there left to do? Obviously, I'm taking the ropes because I think I can still get caught. Apparently, only the guys in the armor will catch me. Hey, guys, what's going on? Well, Risky, are you now saying you're willing to work together? Because last time I checked, you were being an asshole. Also, I didn't realize apparently Shantae's the shortest of the, of the four of them. Like, Risky's the tallest. It's like Risky, Roddy Top, Sky, and then Shantae. Shantae is like the shortest. This is also fucking adorable. You got these girls in goddamn Egyptian princess outfits. Holding, trying to pull down. Wow. You gonna, you gonna start some shit with Sky? This is also the section in which I realized that Sky's hair is blonde. You don't always thought purple because of the shit she wears. Her hair is actually blonde. Wow. Look at these fighting. No, we ain't working together for shit. See, and this is the other thing that makes her cute. This scene also was fucking adorable. She's like, I'm not gonna work with Roddy Tops, but I'll work with you. So it's like, I feel like like Roddy Tops said, like Roddy Tops will work with won't work with Risky, but she will work with Shantae. And I'm like, so you do view her as a friend, and you do you two do like each other. It's just that sometimes you're an asshole. No, no, Sky, she wasn't talking about you. <laughs> You say that, but this game completely contradicts that statement. Don't you call me lover. I like how Shantae's just very submissive in these situations. Oh, hush. Risk it, that's only how you do that. <laughs> Shantae's like, I am terrified. I also wonder in age-wise, is uh, Shantae the youngest? Roddy Jobs, let's be honest here, you just want to do a fan dance. Granted, I wouldn't mind seeing it, but still. I'm not gonna love actually I find like all, all the girls in this series are adorable. Where's my boy Bolo at though? No, Bolo needs to get some shit in. Damn. Disappointing. Hey guys. That, no. What statue? I hope you're not talking about the statue. You mean that statue? How do you mistake any pretty I mean, granted, at least you have good taste, but still, you're mis you're mis mistaking pretty girls for this fat, ugly thing that probably doesn't exist. Are you just retarded? Also, if you're Egyptian, why are you guys wearing like dog masks? Well, I guess that makes sense. It could be like the uh, Anubis, although the damn staff is a snake's head, and all the girls they're just like no. This guy's like, no, no, N no, N no, unless you're talking about the chest area, there's nothing plump about these girls. Oh, what the f- Uh, it's been 30 minutes. Really? And this is why I love the humor in this game. Silly Billy. This is just getting ridiculous. Like, she's just like, I can't do this. She's just like, I'm done. I'm done. It's over. Just, just stop it. Yeah, maybe it's because you're retarded. Can I get my clothes back? Oh, cool. Golden pickaxe. <laughs> and this is Shantae breaking the fourth wall. I got a golden pickaxe. Woo! And it was like, bye, bitch. China's like, well, that was a thing. Um, we're gonna pretend like that didn't happen. Cool, cool. 
Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Wait a minute, guys. They're still doing construction in there. How are we gonna get back to here? Here's your axe. Here's your gun pickups. Yes, you can. Here. Now take it. You do it and put in some work. Hurry up, I got a game to beat. No, no, no. This is for the Wii U and 3DS. There was one. There's, there's one that was originally for the, uh... Those are not birds. Yeah, I'm about to say those are not birds. Lizard did the job. At least I've now gotten into a new section. And we can kill these fucking things. I don't like this. You're gonna make me fight her. Uh, uh. Damn it. I hate this thing. Ah! Uh. Her defense is like stupidly hot. You know what? I had to kill it. She had to die. For the good of the country, I had to kill it. I'm getting hit by something. I don't even understand the point of this section. I think there's probably something here later on, but for right now, this shit doesn't make any sense. And now they're like, oh, I thought you liked her. Also, I don't understand how I got hit here. There it is. Alright, I need to go here. Give me some meat. Give me the meat. Give me the meat. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, oh. Uh. And now we can proceed on to the actual dungeon. Let's see. And this is where you need the hat. Actually, fun note, you don't you can't act, you won't actually die in the uh, watch. You can actually jump in that, you just can't stay there for too long. So it's not like even a one hit death. Oh fucking Ugh. And this is where the pipe ball comes in. Wait, did I die? Oh, I was trying to change the item and I didn't look. I'm stupid. That was stupid of me. Ah! Uh, damn it! Gimme! Actually, by the way, this doesn't kill you! Yeah, I bet you didn't know about this, did you? Wow, this thing fucking jumps far. Oh, by the way, I probably gotta go back in there. Oh my god! Give me that dark magic! Everybody wants to come to Smash, man. Even girls are coming to Smash. Granted, they're not gonna be the ones smashing, but you know. You get what I mean. Gliding to freedom! Get her. Once again, obviously, you need something to get through this. I ain't got time for none of that shit. I'm not even dealing with it. And they can't make me! As I continue throughout my journey. Oh my god, no! Yep, see if you take hits, that becomes the worst section of it all. Which is why I use the pike ball. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Nope, not dealing with none of your shit. And this is where the dungeon starts. Woo! Yep. And obviously I can't get down here. But the weapon we get after the in this area is when the shit gets fun. But for now, I don't want to go that way. That way it doesn't look fun to me. Now we're on to our third dungeon. I definitely don't want to go this way. This doesn't even seem fun to me. 
You know, if you had this to glide, there's really no reason to take the shit unless you just think you're gonna die. And the gimmick of this dungeon is not necessarily anything inherently pissing me off, but you know, it could be better. Like most things in life. This, I think this is the one that relies the most on the blocks. Ah! Yeah. Ah! Do this. Fucking hate this thing. Sarah's I fucking hate this thing. I fucking hate this enemy. This is like one of the only enemies I don't know an effective way to kill. Why? Because God said no. Not my favorite section, if you couldn't tell. But I can do it, and I got the key. Oh, Shovel Knight will probably get in. It wouldn't surprise me. I'm surprised, but to me, partially makes me think that he won't, is because I feel like if he was going to get in, they would have already announced him already. If you're gonna announce an amiibo and not announce him as like a playable character, then my question becomes, why not? Like, my question is like, well, what are you waiting for now? And once again, we got more of these fucking things. By the way, bubble shield stops projectiles. Yeah, I'm not dealing with your shit. Let's continue. Isn't this the way I came down? Well, it probably isn't the way if I went right. So we're just gonna go down. Because why the fuck not? That's the first reason. We can't get anywhere! Using the bubble shit here was kind of retrospectively kind of pointless. I actually don't mind this dungeon though. This dungeon's alright. I can have fun. I can also unlock this section. Unfortunately, I gotta go back now and now I actually got a platform. Which is never always which is never fun. No one wants a fucking platform. What do you think this is a platform game? Get the fuck out of here. Now, I can shoot this, but it's not going to stay open. Yep, see? You got to shoot both of them, so. I got to go over here. And do the other stuffs. Oh, Slicer! Slicer! Sanic! Sanic! <laughs> Sanic! <laughs> and I don't have a key! Fuck! Ah. I need a key! Fuck! Now I get a key! Oh god, I didn't, that took too long. I don't know why I did that. I just came from this area. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure it's not over there. In this situation, we go left now because we don't have anywhere else to go. Look what I can do. 
There's another place to get a key here. Oh, you cheap piece of shit. We're just somewhere over here. Hey, look, it's a save guy. What's up, save guy? It's me, man. How you doing, bud? How you like hanging out in caves by yourself? I hope it's not too rough on you. I apologize. Another platforming section. But also, a map. Now we got the map, which we needed anyway. And according to the map, there are things that, this dungeon actually is kind of short if I remember correctly. I don't know why I fucked up. I fucked up. I shouldn't have done it like that. I actually might be able to correct it. Though. Nope. <laughs> Shit. I hate jumps like that. I hate when a jump is like, oh, you, you could probably make it if you if you timed it right. But you didn't, so... Too bad. Luckily, I can correct my mistake pretty easily here, so... Now we're good. Now we got a key. Yeah, this dungeon's pretty short. <laughs> like, I've already covered, like, almost half the dungeon. It's only been, like, a few minutes. We're gonna save it. Now we're gonna progress. I'm gonna ignore all this shit. Actually, what's over here? I think I've already been here. Yeah, I have. Unfortunately, I still need to unlock the section. Ah! I don't know why I just let myself fall, too. Because I still gotta unlock the damn section. Actually, it might be over here. Let's go down here first. No, nope, wrong door. God damn it. I was fine, I was fine. I should've just took should just took the risk. I'm just taking a whole bunch of unnecessary hits right now. And for that, I apologize. I could kill this fucking damn, that, that damn scorpion. I swear they're like the most annoying enemies to hit because I never know where the goddamn hitbox is. It's like, I know you want me to hit her somewhere, I just don't know where. Click. Now we can progress. Because if you haven't noticed, there's actually an item we need. In every dungeon, we get a new pirate gear. So, with that being stated, we need to fix this shit. Oh my god. Um, where do I go? What do I do? I need a key for that area, so fuck it. Ah, uh, I don't want to do it. Ah, ah, no, no, I don't want to die. No. Where am I actually supposed to go? Over here. So I have the map on the second screen. And granted, it's like this for the 3DS too. It's just for the Wii U version. I gotta actively look down versus the other one where I can just. I'm already looking in the same area. Needless to say, I think this is our new item. Which is pretty much like a down a down smash. That's the best way to describe it. So guess what I can do now? It's pretty much DuckTales. I think it's actually, I don't like it as much as I like the DuckTales one though. I think the DuckTales one controls better. Granted, that is just my opinion, I'm just saying. Personally, I like the DuckTales uh, variation of this than uh, Shantae's. Because I actually do like, I, I do hope we get our, I know we're getting the animal transformations back, so. I'm not too worried. Actually, oh, quick note. That's what I can do. I don't actually have to worry about nailing that jump now. 
Now I still need to get to that top half, which I don't think I can do. I don't know why. There's the other thing I don't like, it like double bounces me. Which is not my favorite thing, but fuck it. Damn, damn, damn. Woo! So unforgiving. Ah, no, fuck that. Get away from me. See? Now I got the key! I got the key, guys! <laughs> I'm stupid. But it's fine, you love me anyways. I hope you do anyway. Love me! Ugh. Ugh. Get out of here. Get out of here! You poses. Get out of here! You fakers. Get out of here! <laughs> oh, shit. And, this, and essentially all I did was I flipped the switch. Well, something was supposed to happen. Yeah, that's what I did. I flipped the switch so I can get back up. Why do I need to get back up? Well, you probably have a good idea of why I need to get back up here. Because there are things that still need to be done, folks. You might be wondering what those things are. I will share it with you now. If you remember a particular section we were at. Yeah, this one. You know there's a whole bunch of stuff down here I can't mess with. That seems like a goddamn injustice. We cannot have that. This thing is so weak. And as I said, don't worry about upgrading this shit. This shit does not need to be upgraded. Some people go, why? You really it does not matter at all. It is nowhere near being a big enough deal to upgrade. Unless you're just a whore. In which case, have at it. Oh, look at that. Ain't that a bitch. We can get it. And now we have another heart squid! Turn ups. Turns ups. Turning ups. Not all those blocks are breakable. Oh, here comes the fun part. Ow! And see now, don't take damage. Slicer! Oh god. My least favorite enemy in the game! I'm surprised I was able to kill her so quickly. I'm surprised that went as well as it did. I actually thought. I remember struggling with that way more before. Oh, here comes the fight. This is like my least favorite section. Because you can get crushed here. See, now this is me taking my time. I don't have to do this. Nor is it really recommended to. But. See, that's kind of scary. But if I want to get through this shit quick, that's what I'm going to do. Now, if you couldn't tell, we're about at that final stretch. We've about gotten stuff done, pretty much. And so, in a desert area, your first suggestion is probably a snake. At least that's my suggestion. It'd be like, oh, it's probably a snake that we're about to go deal with. Um, you might be a little surprised at what we're actually going to go deal with. But let's put on some monster milk and get our asses in here and see what horrors await. Squid Baron, what are you doing? 
Uh, why? Oh my lord, what's wrong? I know, man. I like how Shantae's like, what about fan service? What about the booty? And the boobies? And the sun? And the peace of mind? What? Uh, well, in terms of the game... Wait, what? Wait a minute. This is the fourth wall breaking. What are you doing? What are you what are you talking about? What how do you know these things? What? No, no, Squid Baron, you're better than that. You're better than that, Squid Baron. No, no, Squid Baron! No! No, Squid Baron! No! No, Squid Baron! Are you better than that? <laughs> no! No, oh, Squid Baron! You gave up on your dreams! You're better than that, Squid Baron! You're better! <laughs> Don't give in, Squid Baron! Oh no. Oh no! What the fuck? Squid Baron, don't do it! Squid Baron, no! You're stronger! Yo, Squid Baron! <laughs> no! <laughs> You're better than any filler boss! You're the best filler boss of all time! <laughs> You're better than this! I'm sorry! You had you make me do it! I thought we were buds! Although I have been killing your children. But I thought we were buds! I know, you bat me into a corner! Are you okay? I don't, I don't think I hurt you too badly. What? Are you a masochist? <laughs> like she's like, what? <laughs> um, what? 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 Squ squid. Uh, dude. Uh, I guess, um, you're welcome. Thank you for the map. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, Arigato? When did you become a knight? I'm glad that helped, though. I guess we, we helped him get his group back, so, uh, That's, uh, I guess that's an accomplishment, I guess? I don't fucking know. Squids are weird, man. Squids are weird. What did I get hit by? I get hit by some of Oh, what the fuck? Anyways, so, another den of evil. You know what? I'm getting really sick of your shit, game. Because I'm getting sick of your shit. I'm gonna I'm just gonna proceed on. Life is a highway, I'm just gonna ride it all night long. And I'm just completely skipping everything over here. Although my my level of intrigue won't let me just skip everything. 
My explorer of station says I must come back. And I killed you before you even got a chance to do anything. Give me that dark magic. Mmm. 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 Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Actually, before uh, I head back, probably should go get that heart split. Because why the fuck not? Although I hate this section right here. I wish there was a way I could cheat this section, but I can't, so. I just gotta keep. If anyone remembers the first section now here, I can get it, so. I'm gonna clear out all these rocks, man. Give myself a heart squid. And that's my fifth one. Accomplishments. Money, money, money. Money. Alright. Got the heart squids. Now we can progress back. And I would use my pirate flare and just leave. But I think I still need to go back and get something. I haven't decided this is going to be a 100% run. It might be. Oh, I think it might be. Oh, I think it might be. Turn it. Turn it. You can't catch. Oh, my God. No. Let's eat some chicken just in case. I don't want to deal with any bullshit. Ugh. You ain't gonna defeat me. I'm the celebrator. I'm the man in the back with my nine later. Turning up. Getting drunk. On back of the bitch and getting crunk. I'm gonna dive in. Look at me. This is this Pro Strats. Pro Strats. Esports 2015. <laughs> I told you guys I'm the greatest. You didn't know. You didn't already know. But yeah, there's a Tinker Bat that I can go get, but uh, I need a certain ability to go get it. And as I said, we gotta come back here anyway, so. Just showing you it's over there. I'll probably get it later. Because actually, to get the best thing in the game, you have to get it. Ah. Uh. Of course, you wanted to cheap shot me right before I got up from grass. I'm serious, I hate fighting those fucking things. Because life is hard. Anywho, I'm going back in here for some other stuff. Particularly, we need some dark magic. I will save. I don't have a reason to save. I think I can get some heart squids in here too. Because I'm not overly concerned with that right now. Right now, I just want to get the dark magic. Because technically that is the most important thing. And I also, let's go check out my cell again, you know. Let's get nostalgic for a second. And talk about the good times. Man, I remember this cell. This cell was so cool. Alright, that's another start. Let's get the fuck out of here. Ease, bitch. Woo! I might get to, like, what I'll do is I'll play the main game and then, like, I'll get, like, the heart splits off screen. Hey, you're gonna, you're gonna catch me again? Huh, 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 huh? No! Bitch! 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 <laughs> uh. Now I can use the pirate flare and just get out of here. But. It's kind of a waste of a flare. There's no reason to do that. So I'm not gonna do it. Besides, the walk back isn't even that far. And then we'll round up this part by going back to Skull of Town for some recon shit. 
talking to Sky, maybe saving Barracuda Joe. He's not dead. He's not officially dead. He, he's only mostly dead. So he can still be saved. And that is my intention to save him. I'm just skipping over all the bullshit. Those video games. Look at that. That pro strats. Pro strats. Pro strats. I told you guys I'm the greatest. Alright, we're good, guys. We're good. I don't want to hear that from you. Did you kill them? <laughs> Oh, man. And someone's messaging me. Please ignore that. Oh, wow. Risky, you have a lot of pent-up aggression. God. We're going back home anyway. We're going back to Skittletown. Actually, we gotta go back to Skittletown anyway because of this area. This area is not the most appealing of areas. First things first. First thing we need to do is A, take a bath. After a hard day's work, you always go back home and you take a bath. Remember that, kids, that's how, that's how you get the ladies. The ladies love clean men and women. This guy's mom is around, apparently. Hey, look, there's Bolo! Upgrades like, uh,. Don't spend money on the gun or the sword upgrades. Most of them don't mean shit. Focus on the hair. Don't even worry. Like, the recover is, like, the only other move you need to worry about. Fuck, like, the tune-up and, and the shimitar shit, that don't mean nothing. Like, ignore both of these. Both of these are irrelevant. But focus on the shampoo, the silky cream. Recover is helpful. So we're gonna buy that because it's the only thing we can actually afford right now. And that's and pretty much that's just, you know, recovering from the stupid knockback thing that this game has. Although it's not that much of a detriment here, but you know. Still. Remember that. <laughs> and I don't do we have an auto potion? We don't, but we will buy some. Although I don't think I have enough for auto potion. No, I don't. So we'll buy like two. That way, we're covered for a while. And with that, there's some other stuff we got to do, but I'll do that next part. For the most part, we have covered another den. We got another sword. Feeling good, feeling accomplished. Proud of us. We done good. We done good. Good work, team. Good work. So. I'll end this part here. This is part three. Part four, I might go ahead and try to do tomorrow. Since part four isn't... Part four is kind of annoying, but it's not insanely annoying. Although I do think it houses the worst boss in the fucking game. Which you'll see when we get to it. But for right now, that is Shantae in the Pirate's Curse part three. Our bikini desert adventure. And, uh... Yeah. So I'm about to go watch some Dura Go to the gym and be somewhat productive. And maybe play some Splatoon later on tonight. Anywho, this has been the Insane Game Freak. Hope you guys enjoy it. Like some game, play the win. And I will catch you guys later. Hey, 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 hey. So.